the diesel fraction. So e-kerosene is basically hydrocarbons and it tells it all. It's hydrogen and carbon. So you need the two resources and brings them together in a synthesis gas and then synthetically produce the hydrocarbon chains out of it. So you have the two feedstock coming in here. One is carbon dioxide and on the other hand you have hydrogen and those two are then here mixed together to synthesis gas and out of this is then synthetically formed ecorosine in this plant. So the food waste is only a CO2 source for the beginning. In the long run we need to rely on direct air capture and this is also beneficial for the climate if we uh, extract the carbon directly from the atmosphere. And we are starting here at small volumes but we will scale it up and uh, soon it will be 100% direct air capture. Our mission of Ineratech is that we will build our plants all over the world. Wherever you have access to cheap electricity, where you, have, where you can harvest solar, where you can harvest wind. This can be in South Africa, this can be in South America, this can be in the MENA region, this can be in Australia. Wherever you can build up renewable energy capacities and store the renewable energy then in these liquid fuels and utilize it in existing infrastructures. But through cheap solar mainly, um, it, it can be possible in the future to produce uh, e-fuels that are as cheap as fossil fuels today. And maybe there is some gap uh, also, also in the future which can be bridged with CO2 pricing. So. It is something that in the industry all participants together need to in the end finance. So it will be the end consumers, uh, it will be uh, intermediaries and it will be the air, uh, air industry companies. Yeah. And this project is very, very important because it shows that climate neutrality in 2045 is possible also in aviation. And we need um, the dream of aviation. Still, the people want to fly. And so flying has to be sustainable. And, uh, and this, um, this uh, day today shows that it is possible. We have all the knowledge, we have all the technology we need to make uh, flying uh, sustainable uh, with uh, e-fuels, with e-kerosene.